It's Madden NFL 24, and the question is, are you ready for some football? It's the Dolphins and the Chiefs, coming up next. Thanks for joining me. Week 9, wide receiver Chris Mack, superstar mode, taking on the Dolphins, Frankfurt Journey. We come in ranked number 1, offense ranked number 30 defense. See what we can do against these Dolphins. I know. If you like this content, please like, share, and subscribe. And let's get to it. Enjoy. It was a momentous day of football ahead. Now, last year we had our first ever regular season game here in Germany. That was down in Munich. Today, Frankfurt gets the spotlight, the first of two in this hub of commerce. And this is you. The Chiefs offense about ready to get started. 8 0 is their record to start the year. And the one we'll be watching is this man at wideout. You see the numbers for the first half. Because his ability to get downfield, attract extra attention, helps open up things for everyone else on offense as well. And I certainly wouldn't be surprised if he improves his numbers in the second half of the year as well. Fights forward for only about a yard up to the 21. Now the numbers on the ground for Pacheco last week. Touch the football because if you're a defense, you absolutely have to key on him. On second down, here's Mahomes. Got his man complete over the middle. That's Mack. And they're going to get this beyond the 40 before he's taken down. That one, a gain of 20 and a first down. And that's a more than acceptable read right there because it's zone coverage, so timing is everything. This time he waits for his man to come open, puts it right on him, and they pick up a first down. First and ten, here's Pacheco. And able to break one tackle, but then quickly brought down. But a nice little game. And hold on here, because on that last run, it looks like we have a player who was shaken up. The ball on the 47-yard line. Here's second and four. Here's Pacheco once again. And he'll be taken down at the 44-yard line. Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down in the league had to come into this game with the idea slow him down otherwise it's going to be a long afternoon meanwhile the homes throw here complete to Kelsey and he'll cross over out of bounds right at the 25 19 yards there on the catch Get this man involved as well and that's what they just did on that play now a toss left for Pacheco and some determined running there as he'll pick his way down to the 12-yard line. Another nice gain, 13 yards. Those things, and it looks like it's going like clockwork right now for them. On first and ten, here's Mahomes. And it is caught. Touchdown, Kansas City. A great play there with a lucky number 13 touchdowns now on the year. And the Chiefs are on the board first here this afternoon. One of the keys to their long winning streak has been scoring first. An ideal drive right there, getting the first six points of the ball game. Do you go back to our meeting with the offensive coordinator? Oh, Remember yeah. what he told us? Absolutely. With some teams, I script to probe in the early part of the game. Kansas City taking the field for their second drive. Sitting in first place in the division it has some extra importance. It certainly does because if they can get the win here and pad their lead a bit or at least keep pace, then they can really kick their feet up and say a job well done at this point and not have to worry about ball at all until they're back in their facility, back in their meeting room, getting ready for the next game. But that might not be their thing. Oftentimes, they'll be the ones getting the penalties. Mahomes going to throw. And his throw is going to be incomplete. So yes. they'll come up after the incompletion for second down. Now here's Mahomes. Man open, that's Marquez Valdez Scantler. And he's taken down, but not before he gets this across the 25-yard. Drive that picked right up where they left off. Another good throw there, 
And this offense, humming here in the early going. A bit of an opening there on the first down run as they get this forward for about six yards. Coming up after this, so I guess my question, any worry that maybe this is coming at the wrong time? Oh, definitely I would be worried about this game maybe more than any other on the schedule because I know my guys are looking ahead to that open week. I've got to keep them focused on the task ahead. Make sure they take care of business in this one. Otherwise, well, as we start the second quarter, as they've got it with a second and four coming up, they'll bring a receiver in motion right. Now here's a fake on the jet sweep as they'll go instead with Pacheco. Here, third and five. Here's Mahomes to throw. I had a man open, but he missed him, and it's incomplete. Now that's a good bounce back after giving up a touchdown on the opening drive. Just one first down permitted, and then out. Obviously no loss of confidence with that defense, and now they get to turn it back to their offense. So here are the Chiefs to take over. They've gone two months without a loss. Eight straight wins for them, and they've got the lead here in this one as well. They'll start the drive here with Pacheco. And he'll get this up just shy of the 30. I feel like I could see on the carry. I think he had designs on that one being bigger. Now Mahomes throwing on second down. He finds his man complete. It's Mack. This one good for a first down. So maybe they want to go to a zone blitz scheme, get a little bit more pressure. Remember when Carolina did that against Denver? They lost the game ultimately. They dropped the defensive end out, and he ended up with... All right, rifles one, and that's going to be intercepted. Picked up by Xavier Howard. And the Dolphins are going to have the short field here as they'll take over right at the 50. Well, this had trouble written all over from the start. He's got two extra defensive backs in the game he's got to deal with. They're in a dime set. So everywhere he's looking, he's seeing a different color jersey. And sure enough, the Chiefs ready to rock again on offense. Well, partner, fast forward with me for a second. Remember, next week they have the open week, so they're going to get some extended rest. But not by too much, because you're right. You get the extra rest, you get a chance to heal up and kind of, you know, do a little bit of a reset for this team. But it's also seven extra days to think back to the last time you were on the field. So now, a little more importance on what they're getting done because they carry it with them for essentially two weeks. From the 44-yard line, here's second down and two. On the handoff, it's Pacheco. And he's going to be met at about the 43. Just a gain of a yard there for a win in the defense's column. On third down, it's Pacheco. And he's got the first before he's brought down at the 39-yard line. Sure, they went in and went heavy. No surprise on who was going to get the football. How about the power exhibited there? Yeah, that was just put a hat on a hat, drive forward. Nice job to pick it up. A pass complete downfield. It's Valdez Scantling. And in for the Chiefs touchdown. Marquez Valdez Scantling, 39 yards. And the Chiefs are able to widen their advantage. So the quarterback drops to throw, looks over, and boom, a guy that wide open, he has to be thinking, wait a minute, this is some kind of a dream. This is too easy. Yeah, a great dream, one you don't want to wake up from. But for the defense, almost feels like there was a bust in coverage. At Kansas City's offense now, set and ready to go. And not an abundance of time remains on the clock, Charles, but you would think more than enough to try to extend and great momentum to carry into the locker room. Throwing on first down is Mahomes. To Valdez Scantling over the middle. And this will leave him a yard short. 29 now, they'll head to the line. Second and a yard. Now Mahomes. He finds his man complete. That's Mack. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. 19 yards the pick up there. Move the chains. Good strong throw and catch right there. And so far in this game, the alleys have been open for them to get complete. Back good plays. Have them on the move on first down. 
to throw. It's Mahomes. And that's incomplete. Clock stops with 10 seconds left. Because of the angles of approach. When you're going to get him, sometimes you panic as well and think, I've got to be there right now. Instead, in this case, timed it perfectly and knocked it free. It's Kelsey on the ground. And he gets this inside the 35-yard line. Mahomes to throw once more. And too much juice. It'll be out of bounds, incomplete. And you see the clock almost empty, so this is likely the last play in the second quarter. Final shot before the half for Mahomes. The tight end Kelsey has it over the middle. And he's got another first down as he's brought down at the Dolphins' 35. So we have reached halftime here in an 11-point contest. As we send you back across the Atlantic to Orlando, as we say, guten tag to our guys standing by. That's this Jonathan has certainly Coach been a fun Coach. one to watch so far. We knew this was going to be a battle, and we have not been disappointed. This is the kind of game that could wind up hinging on which side can play mistake-free football the rest of the way. In the first half, it was the reigning league MVP and Super so probably an empty box establishing the run. They're on pace for fewer than 100 yards in this one. So now they want to make sure that they get that going so they truly have a control in this ball game and down the stretch. Come up now second and four from the 31. Mahomes now to throw. And that went too far in front. He couldn't reel it in. It's incomplete. We're doing four-minute offense yet. But they've got to think about, I'm not going to say milking the clock, but understanding clock management here on out. They'll look to throw. They'll set up the screen to Pacheco. And past the 40 before he's out of bounds. An 11-yard pickup, and it's enough for a Chiefs first down. And when you have success throwing the football, the old cliche becomes true. The playbook opens up wide. And these screen passes, they become even more difficult. Mahomes now on first down. Over the middle complete. It's Mack. And they'll get him down as he's inside the 40. Another nice gain. That's now 30 yards. Two score lead in the third quarter. They almost become defensive with their offense, just playing not to lose. I think with this team, you got to figure at this point, this is a great spot for them to go into attack mode. Really try and put the hand in your second down play. Second down and a yard. Handoff now for Pacheco. And he'll go down at the 28. And hold on here, because on that last run, it looks like we have a player who was shaken up. Well, now they're going to come out and take a look at this inch. Mahomes now on first down. And a quick throw here, that's complete. Down he goes at the 23. A pick -up. Second down and six now. Throwing now is Mahomes. He completes this one to Mack. That'll put him at 95 receiving. Working from the gun, Mahomes. He's going to hit his man out of the backfield, complete. And he's brought down just outside of the generate big plays for an offense. Mahomes to throw on second down. This is caught. And he's brought down. They picked up five yards. And they'll let the fullback try and take him home. And he is in. Touchdown, Kansas City. It's the fullback. His first touchdown on the year. And the Chiefs take the opening kickoff of the third quarter and drive right down the field to extend their lead. That drive that really increased their cushion felt very military to me. Very precise, methodical, as one of the words you've taught me. And they just got it done. And slowly but surely now starting to pull away a little bit. Things looking good for them here in the third quarter. Not only. And now here comes Kansas City. 
This is sort of what you would call a put-away drive. Is they, they score here, especially a touchdown, it's almost out of reach. There, and the game's going to go on. You think you can take the spirit away from another team, that their drive and will to come back and win can be taken with another score right here. It's still third quarter, but you just get that feel. Yeah, they're teetering right there on the brink, aren't they? And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 30. Often known as the nasty side. The left side, usually the technical side. Kind of reminds me of the old Atlanta Falcons 2009-2010. That's how they constructed their offensive line. On first down, Mahomes. That ball is caught. Marquez Valdez scambling. And he'll be brought down on what's going to turn out to be the final play of this third quarter. We have played three quarters. We'll return with more after this break. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Quarter number four. So now first and ten as they've crossed into Miami territory at the 45-yard line. And he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. This drive starts with two steps forward and now one back. Between that and a pass blitz, pass blitz, you're just trying to get to the quarterback. You're trying to scheme someone open who will get to the QB and make sure he gets on the ground. In a run blitz, you're actually trying to cover up gaps, trying to cover up holes so they can't run the fence. Who can blame them? The Chiefs on third down. They've been good, three for four thus far. Here it's third and three. Looking to throw is Mahomes. Got his man complete over the middle. That's Mack. And he's going to be stopped up right at the line of scrimmage. So they'll get nothing out of that play. And that's going to make it fourth down. As a defense, you're more balanced when you're in zone coverage because you're able to keep your eyes on the quarterback. He finds his man. Complete. It's Mack. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. The Chiefs have got the passing game rolling a bit. And another first down. Partner, I like that they're staying aggressive on offense because to me, this drive is what is known as a put-away drive. You score here, that might put this one to bed. I like the fact that they're playing with confidence and not playing with fear. So here's a first and 10 now down inside the 20. Operating from the red zone now, Mahomes. Open man right side is Tony. Call it a gain of six on the play. They'll look to throw. They'll check this one down to Pacheco. And the Chiefs are going to be set up in the passing game, and there he picks up another first down. Whatever they saw going into this one, they've been able to capitalize on it, and no adjustment has been made to take it away. 75 yards rushing for him now in the ball game. Before, haven't we? Because every coach we've ever talked to says body language is important. And now you're seeing guys with their hands on their hips, they're bent over, hands on their knees. And the offensive guys are just saying, let's just keep running it out. We've got them now. They'll wind up losing a yard on the play. And now we've got a third and goal situation. Heck of a play there to get to him quickly and get him down for a loss. I think they did a really nice job getting... Here's the Kansas City offense now as they get set to take over. If they can score here, they have a chance to make this a three. And they try with Pacheco. And a good job of finding the open space to run as he's down close to the 30 here. Continues to move. No better way to close out a game than to tap those mastodons you have up front and say, guys, keep pounding them. Let's keep the ball, keep their offense on the sidelines, and let's close this one out. And the result here, a pickup of eight. And look at that play chart that the play caller has in his hands right now. That's what you got to focus in on because that's divided up by sections. And right now, he's looking at that four-minute offense section. What running plays do we have to bleed down the clock and take care of the quarterback? A good quarterback like he is to not play too much zone. Yeah, you have to be careful about how much time you're giving up. I think it's a good point. You just put it front. Defensive end, defensive tackle. It doesn't matter. You just exchange someone to bring more pressure towards the quarterback. To imagine this will be on the ground as well as they come up second and seven. Mahomes on the give to Edwards. It's third and three. Now 
Now the Georgia Southern man. The Chiefs here, and no surprise, it was Patrick Mahomes who really led the charge. Yeah, the numbers don't jump off the page, but he was a steady influence back there. He had a couple of times.